Hello everyone, this is Sunil here. We're going to be talking about the trigger. What exactly is the trigger? Let's get started. So till now we have seen how to directly run a task. You just right click and run it. Then you run it. Right? It runs. Or you can do it using task editor and then you click the run button. That's how you run the job. So that's how uh, we have seen how to directly run it. Right? Now we will see how to run it based on a particular trigger. So what exactly is a trigger? Trigger is something like let's say you're watching a YouTube video. Once the YouTube video ends, then you start a task. So that's one uh, silly example of what exactly is a trigger. It's nothing but it's a particular type of event. Right? So you can see there are different type of events that are there. So uh, for example, window, file, folder, performance, process, servers, email, message, all this um, are nothing but the different trigger types so I think you are pretty much confused till now you will see don't worry so let's see the example of window so in window uh, let's say when a particular window opens or when a particular window closes then this particular trigger will be I mean this uh, task will start right so uh, that's what this means right I, I know you still still you uh, don't understand but let's see so uh, let's see what is there in this sample particular thing right it's getting lower right now you can see here the message box uh, it's just particular message let's begin learning it's a very simple uh, thing right it's a very simple task so let's say what we will do is uh, we will set this particular tasks right based on when the particular window opens right so now I need to select the particular window title so what exactly is a window title so for example you can see this is uh, this folder open this uh, particular window right so you can also trigger based on that particular uh, thing so that you can do it or uh, literally anything like let's say let's say particular notepad application right so let's say uh, so let's say I have now opened the op uh, notepad now let me refresh it right let me refresh it just refresh now you will see can you see this notepad earlier it was not there now it is coming up right so so now what I want to do is I just created a trigger based on so what it means is if um, if a window opens uh, when you're opening a notepad window then this particular task will run understand very simple right so uh, I've already created this particular task right now if I uh, open this particular notepad so just see I open the notepad now let's see if it runs or not can you see can you see right so now now, now you're getting probably what exactly is a trigger it's very simple when you do something s the job runs right your task run so that that's exactly what is a trigger so what is that something something can be anything like when you close a window when you open a window can be literally anything right so this one was pretty simple example now let's see some other stuff so similarly when you particular uh, close a particular window then you would like to uh, start a trigger so then this particular task will run right or there are multiple other things as well let's say the file one so let's see on the file side what are the different accent types uh, that are there then you can see here when file is created deleted renamed modified then I would like uh, to run this particular task right it's very simple right so let's see a particular demonstration then probably you will understand so let's say when this file is created then uh, or let's say uh, when the file is deleted then uh, just you just need to specify the file name so just let's just select the file name <coughs> sorry so just select a file name so what I'm trying to do here is if you select that file then this thing will be uh, this, this trigger will be when this file is deleted this particular file the log file let's say I select it it means when I delete this log file then my task should run so uh, as you can see the task got created right um, you can see here it has edited but not added but if you want to add a new task a new trigger you can also add a new trigger as well so that depends right so you can create multiple triggers as well on a particular task that's uh, simple so let's just see the demonstration of this let's just delete this file and see if uh, our job is running or not so just delete this particular file so I can you see this can you see this so this trigger got started and I saw the message so I hope you understood by now what exactly is a trigger it's quite simple 
let's see some more demonstrations i want to make you an expert on this thing uh, let's say when a file is created right so just choose this let's say uh, if i create this particular file right then this uh, should be triggered that's simple let me just add it right uh, add file right then choose the particular file name just uh, select the folder and just say log dot uh, log dot txt right simple right so i just given the path name can you remember this file is not i mean presently it's not there right so when you create this file then it will be triggered so can you see here i